Good morning. This is a video tutorial about using Google Picasa through the Gladinet client. You can see how the Gladinet client enhances your user experience of the Google Picasa. First of all, I will use Picasa to upload some images. Now switch over to the Gladinet client. If you haven't started the Gladinet client, you need to start it first. Normally it's started when you log in into Windows and it stays in the sys tray. Open my storage drive. There's no Google Picasa folder yet. I will need to configure it once using the Virtual Directory Manager. Add Google Picasa. Virtual Directory name, the name you will see in Windows Explorer. Hosting device name is not used when you are not using the re remote folders from remote machines. Safe card. If I'm using the same account same Google account as the Google Docs, I can share the same login information. Since I'm using a different account, I'm going to type in my credentials now. Google Picasa virtual folder was added. Now switch over to the browser interface to view the images. Make sure they are there. This is how you would use it the normal way. This is the folder I uploaded through the Picasa. As you can see, these four images are the same as these four images. You can see here, what if I want to download the pictures to a different machine? There's a there's an option download album. And I can go through the wizard here to download it. What if instead of having only two albums, I have 30 or 40 albums. If you want to download them all, you have to go through them one by one. So it's not very convenient to download pictures from Picasa. Now using the Gladinet client. Google Picasa folder. I see the same two albums here. And you see the same four pictures. If I want to download an album, drag and drop.
and I can also drag and drop pictures directly into the folder here and they will be saved into the Google Picasa online storage. And you can imagine me doing this on a different machine and that simplifies the download process of Google Picasa. So you can upload using Picasa the normal way from any machine and later on when you are ready to aggregate all those pictures to a different machine you can use Gladinet client to download the albums you can you can multi-select and drag and drop them all to a different machine this is the end of the video tutorial again it's about using Google Picasa through the Gladinet client for more information please visit Gladinet website Thanks for watching.